This is called hype. I never trust Mouse. Ever since we was in standard six, you don't know what next he would do. But he owe me. And lifting down the is easier with, easier with two. But to tell you the truth, if I didn't know he was so useless, I would have done the job myself. At night we fix for the action, I tell Mouse the one thirty. He reach out two o'clock, half past two. Dressed like he wanted to get picked out in finger parade. Pretty, pretty shirt. Styly pants, bandana around his head. When he would check the white man leaving John was bar, I give Mouse the nod and we start to follow. Even then, Mouse can't do that properly. He walking sideways like a crab. I said, what happened to you, Mousey? He said, see a man walks on a picture show one time. Before I put two lash in his head, the white man reached the, reached the car. What a higher car. Nothing special. I hold the piece and Mousey do the job. We used to do this be done for you have to tap them up to show them you mean business. It don't mean nothing. The man full of liquor, but as soon as they see the piece, he rest his two hands on the car door. I tell Mousy, take your time, extract the dancey, and we head down the road. <laughs> Instead of them crackle, come out the bar, mind their own business, and start to follow. One set of ball in behind, and stop them, stop them, thief. I would have bust two shots in the backside, but every time I turn around, Mousy prancing behind me, galloping like a horse, arms swinging all over the place. Next thing I know, he bumps a wall. Wallet, money, card spread all over the sidewalk, the gut of the street. I put the shoes in my waistband. See man scramble for Dunsey with two hands, but the crap was closing in and we had to get the hell out. By the time we duck in by an empty tumble down house in George Street. No Dunsey, no shooter. I get so vexed. I give Mousy two good cup in the head and leave him for the crap <laughs> I don't know what happened to him. I'm not working with him again and you better tell me the $200 you owe me again. 